distress signal. Distress signal. Starship Rangers assemble. Rescue mission drop down in three minutes. All right, people! You heard it! This is a rescue mission! Get your zappers, set them to pew! Pew, pew! pew. Oh, hey, Taz! You're pretty tough for a chick. I was just going to say the same thing about you. Whoa! Sparks! Yeah, full talent! Scan the surface of this planet. I want to know what's going on down there. I'll try, Lieutenant, but gamma storms are interfering with my equipment. My spectrometer readings are off the walls. Drop down in two minutes, 30 seconds. Ooh. Oh, excuse me, little girl. I'm, I'm new, and I was just wondering, uh, what's this? Oh, that's your zapper. What's that? It's a gun, stupid. You shoot stuff with it. Oh, that's not what I was using it for. Sorry. Well, you see where I come from? Far planet? We don't have or know much of nothing. That's why I joined the Starship Rangers. I mean, today alone, I found out that this is a gun. And I saw the empirical proof that science killed God. It's comforting to know that he was once alive, though. I like to think that when he died, he went to heaven. Hey! You better get out of my face, Essie. I'm prepping for a rescue mission. Oh, no, I know. I'm assigned to the rescue mission, too. Hey, my name is Tootsie Noodles. What kind of name is that? Well, you see where I come from, farm planet? Your first name is what you do, and your second name is what you like. So I'm called Tootsie, on account of my occasional toot and noodles, cause I like them. You see where I come from? Gaiate! What am I supposed to do with you? Do you know nothing? Well, I'm willing to learn, sir. I should warn you though, I'm a slow learner. Hey, hey, what's this? So, this is the rescue squad, huh? Hey, look at you. None of you have what it takes to serve under Commander Up. The Commander Up? The war hero, my legend. Hell, even on Far Planet, we heard of him. I heard he once took down a bird of prey which could fire while cloaked with his bare hands. He's got bare hands. <laughs> yeah, well, I heard he went soft. <laughs> Yeah, he used to be all that in a bag of Flavo Fives, but now he's like a total wimp. Like the other day, he was in the cafeteria just crying in front of everybody. Hey! You got something to say about the commander? Uh, no, no, oh, no, I forgot. You guys fought in the robot wars together. Yeah, crayon there, where he saved my life a hundred times. Well, yeah, he was like a super soldier. What do you mean? Was. Uh, nothing, man. I just heard about his injury. <gasps> I mean, his famous injury that everyone knows about. You know, the one the robots gave to him? Oh, man, those robots must have really messed him up because I just, like, heard this rumor going around that he might have maybe gone a little bit soft. Put your hand on that wall. What? Why? Put your hand on that one! <laughs> Wait, please don't throw a knife in my hand! Oh, quit messing around, oh. man! It's not funny! Oh, oh, don't throw a knife! Yeah, don't! <laughs> okay. <sighs> oh! You! Listen to me now, you little fart! Uh. Oh! He's the toughest son of a bitch I ever met in my life! You stabbed me! He eats. He eats eagles for breakfast. He sleep on a bed of fire. And when Op cuts an onion, the onion is the one who cry. I'm dying. So you better unfudge yourself, or Op will unscrew your hand and drop the wishing pennies down your throat. Now take a walk off my knife. Ah. Oh, oh, does that hurt you? Oh, walk it off! Commander on deck. Drop down in two minutes. Yeah, fall in. And you better pray that I'll like your stupid faces, or he might just rip them off.
boys and girls. I'm Commander Up. Now, I'm sure you've all heard some no good, nasty, downright mean-spirited rumors about me floating around the ship. And I bet you're all wondering to yourselves, are they true? Well, go on, ask me. Ask me right to my mug. Yeah, that's right. You're afraid to ask me. Because one look at this. And it's all you need to know that there ain't a lick of truth to them. I do not pee pee sitting down. Hmm? I never did it. And the one time that maybe you heard about, it was because the gravity was on too high. All right, so you try me to be standing up when the gravity is on three times too high, all right? I don't be me sitting down. I be me like a big boy, that goddammit. I be me like a big boy, so stop making fun of me because it hurts my feelings. Chop down in one minute. Oh, jeez. Oh, what are you doing, Ty, man? you believe me, I pee pee like a big boy. Shut up. <laughs> You're supposed to give them some speech to scare and inspire them. Remember, like in the old days, like, if you don't go out there and die for something, then I will kill you for nothing. Remember? <laughs> like, tough. Yeah, uh, yeah. Damn it. All right. All right. Everybody, I goofed up. If you give me some of your patience, well, I'd like to try again. Give me one moment to regain my confidence, and I'll give you a speech that's scarier than an apple in your candy basket on Halloween. <laughs> so big, so <sighs> oh. Oh, the doctor at the rehabilitation center says that this is good for me. <sighs> you are a worthwhile person. <sighs> when I look into your eyes in the mirror, I get a pleasant feeling. You're not a failure overall. <laughs> you can laugh at yourself. <laughs> Don't laugh at me, you overall failure. Why, when I look into your eyes, I get an unpleasant feeling. Oh, take this. Oh, Taz, is it bleeding? You didn't even break the glass. Figures. Couldn't even break the glass. <laughs> Drop down in five seconds. Oh, Whoa, hey there, gang. Thank dead God I caught you before drop down. I just wanted to get a chance to introduce myself. My name's Junior. Maybe you heard of me. Or my dad. He's the head of the whole Galactic League. Oh, I heard of your dad. Yeah, I'm his son. Nice. I'm also this starship's ambassador to the Galactic League. Uh-oh, I know what you're thinking. Who's this ignorant gringo trying to flex on my shit? <laughs> but rest assured, I'm not here to ruffle anybody's feathers. Quite the opposite, actually. Just here to watch you fly. And make sure this mission is run according to Galactic League standards. But don't tell anybody, okay? <laughs> Guys, I needed the best for this mission. That's why I handpicked each and every single one of you. Just like I handpicked February. Drop down in one second. So what are you waiting for, guys? Get down there! And when you rescue February, tell her Junior sent you. Drop down in 20 oh, seconds. No, wait, one more thing. Forgot, sorry. I've got something that's going to make your job down on that planet a whole heck of a lot easier. It's the most advanced piece of technology that the Galactic League has to offer. Allow me to introduce you to the final member of your team. Mega Girl! <laughs> Please state a command for me to service you. <laughs> <laughs>